straight into it, so let's not delay. I'm quite nervous because I know they English stats are not really uh, yeah, quite overrated. But uh, if you want, we could probably take a look at the group table if you want. Uh, let's take a look at the groups are the same as the Astro World Cup. So you could see in Group B, England is on top with three points. So Trinidad and Tobago. That's right, Kenwin, we won the first game. And uh, Sweden and Paraguay. So we have to play England up next. So uh, let's get to it. Um, I'm, I'm not going to lie, I'm a bit nervous because people are looking at us live. And uh, I, I'm, I'm really trying to get something done for Trinidad and Tobago. So we're going to go with the red uniform. You guys could let me know what the uniform was. I can't remember if we played with the red or not, but you know, um, England are definitely going to be a quite a difficult team. It's interesting because I, I'm seeing that they're playing a 4 4 2. Uh, I'm thinking to stick with the same lineup that I went with last time, you know. Um, you know, that seems to work. Uh, so we have a pretty decent squad. It's not exactly what took place at the World Cup, but. Um, you know. Okay, okay. I think we're gonna play the four five one like we did last time around, so we're just gonna stick with the same formation. Alright, so advance to the game. England is the home to a number of the world's most famous authors, such as Jane Austen, Charles Dickens and William Shakespeare. It's cool facts and I like I said, I really like the intro for this game. Um it's really old, it's two thousand and six. But uh you know whatever so as you as i said before i can skip through this but i won't because i'm enjoying the atmosphere these are the authentic stadiums and i have to i, I have to say this i've played all the new fifas and i feel the atmosphere a bit more in this game so um you know don't forget to like subscribe i'm i'm not a regular streamer so i'm pretty sure all you streamers out there could give me some tips on any technical advice i may need should i use twitch should i use xsplit what should i use uh, obs studios let me know uh, the graphics are a bit choppy. Um, I don't know. I've tried my best to adjust the settings, and this is the best I can get it. So, you know, this is going to be a tough game. I'm going to play the three lions. So, Paul Robinson, Gary Neville, John Terry, and all those guys were stars at the time. Michael Owen and Wayne Rooney. So, I'm pretty sure Brent Sancho and those guys will want me to get one over on those guys. So, we started off really well. The objective is to get out of the group, and let's do that. So, let's do this, guys. Whew, wish me luck. So here we go, here we go guys, England has a kickoff. So we're going to go with the same approach, we're going to try, England is obviously going to be a lot faster and you can see that. So we're going to play how we want to play, these guys show their competence, it's not like we beat some slouches uh, before, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And you can hear the uh, ole 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 Trinidadian style which is very authentic if you listen in the background. And I hope YouTube doesn't take my video down for that. Oh my god, not good. I didn't get as much, I'm not getting as much space I got in the Sweden game. Good win back. Let's try to keep the ball guys, let's try to keep it calm. There's no help. Ah! It's hard to dribble in this game, it's hard to dribble in this game. So Ashley Cole. Just don't, don't overcome it guys, don't, don't let him pull us out. These English players have a lot of pace. Well done Bucho. Oh my god. Okay, okay guys. Let's, let's calm things down. Let's calm things down. Let's, let's try to try to get through the half. Uh, Beckham is going to do a ridiculous cross. So what we have to do is try to keep the the pace of the game. Not, oh my god. Okay, I definitely don't have the same space that I had the first, first time around. It's quite difficult. Okay, so I'm going to try to control the pace. Wow. Okay a lot tougher it's a lot tougher the mechanics for those who play fifa it's it's very different finally we, we're getting some possession these guys are pressing me really hard um you know we have to oh is it oh my gosh hit the post come on guys let's, let's be calm guys let's be calm Pressuring, let's take advantage through ball. Oh my god, we've got two chances, guys. Please, if you guys know how to help me finish a lot better, I'm, I'm not doing a good job. Let's calm down, let's calm down. Gerard, I'm not gonna let you do to what you did to Shaka last time around. I may not be able to talk much because I really want to win this game. Oof. 
this game is already a lot more difficult. So let's calm things down, Shocker. 18 minutes and it's pretty open. Uh, way more aggressive than the Swedish team. Uh, we created two clear-cut chances, but so did England. Uh, the, the man marking is very aggressive. Um, you know, we're gonna have to try to... Oh my god. I have to admit, I don't know, maybe if I'm nervous, I'm giving, doing a lot of giveaways. I don't like to play this fast. It does not sit well with me. Ah. Come on, come on, you're quick. <sighs> Even the screen is making me dizzy. It's quite quick. So I tried to adjust the setting, folks, to make it really well. Okay, Bochel, well done. Let's let's be smart. Any anybody in support? No, there's no one in support. Oh. Not getting the. I was a bit more talkative in the first game because it's definitely a lot easier. Don't take chances, guys. Let's slow things down. You know, I'm, I'm going to use the Pellegrini tactic that he used at Villarreal. You know, uh, he never changes pace for the game. Oh, sorry, Edwards. Good thing about this, the defending, uh, the physics for the game is very different, so you can you can defend a bit different. I think if I was playing the new FIFA, oh, I probably would have been out muscled by some of these guys. Come on, guys, no giveaways. Come on. Oh my God, I miss. the pace is so much quicker. Wow, you just bundle Russell out of be over. Well done, Lawrence. Come on, this is it. This is it. Come on, come on, come on. It's early in the game. I hate scoring really early, but... Very good, very good. My heart rate's up. My heart rate's up, folks. My heart rate is up. Look at that replay. Lovely, guys. Lovely. <sighs> guys. If we do this right, and I get a good result here, we can, you know, secure ourselves to the qualifying the next round. Well done. Well done, guys. My palms are sweating. Let's go again. Let's be calm. They're going to attack us. They were attacking us from the very beginning. Um, they are very strong. Come on, guys. Keep the lines of four. Okay, they're starting to turn on the dribbling. Joe Cole. Okay, come on, get that out. Wow. That is a ridiculous header. There's no way you can get that much power from outside the box. I hope the game is not doing what happened in real life. Okay, the replay. The cameraman is obviously asleep. Look at that. I mean, you can't really see it, but that header was ridiculous. Okay, guys, I'm a bit worried here. This is... I don't think I, Sweden even got a proper corner. We're definitely going to have to control the game, guys. Come on, get that out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is definitely, definitely a different game, folks. Oh, I tried. I tried. Ooh, this is tough, guys. This is tough. Oh. England definitely is giving me a hard time. So any complacency I probably had in the first game. Wow. Well done. Okay, so in the other game, I had a lot more control over the players. I definitely don't have it. Come on, let's, let's don't burn Russell out. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow, that was different. If you're just joining us, this is the second game of my World Cup 2006 campaign where I'm trying to win with my country, Trinidad and Tobago. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you're new. <laughs>
jazz chords Me, I'm trying to simplify But don't get me wrong I'm in this shit sh too long But stand right here and justify Um, you know, this is the second game. We won the first game. You know, I'm pleasantly surprised and we're 1-0 ahead against England. This game is a lot... Di this second game is definitely different. The physics of this game is different. We hit the post and we scored a goal. So, um, you know, I'm going to try to, 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 to keep it calm because England did create some chances. You can see their stats are vastly superior to my players. And for the streamers out there, you know, who uh, have any opinions on this, let me know what you all think about the stream. If you have any suggestions, let me know. It's all open here. And for the people, the Trinidad Trin Trin Tobago fans, the Warrior fans, um, I'm trying to uh, do a, a list of all the players. Look at that header, that's ridiculous. Outside the box and he almost scored, but well done, Shaka. Um, I'm trying to get the, the team list of all the players. I'm sure I can Google it, but you guys can do that for me. So, uh, it was very difficult. The game physics are very difficult, but we're going to head into the second half. We're going to head into the second half. Come on, Tony Roach. Roach looks nothing like himself. Um, you know, we have a little fun episode with Kenwin Jones where we get them to guess their appearances. And, you know, Kenwin Jones will be the first guy. So come on, guys. Uh, you know, England's going to come out really hard in this first, in first couple of minutes in the second half. I may not be coherent in my commentary because the fact is I don't want to lose. And it's hard to concentrate. Come on, Edwards. You know, they're pressuring really high now. We could take advantage of that. You know, we can take advantage of that. Come on, Russell. Oh. And maybe should try to keep... It's very difficult. The first game against Sweden, it was easier to hold on to the ball. I'm trying not to... You can see they're trying to pull me out. Uh, the AI is interesting. Uh, they have England as you know, pretty aggressive. English players don't normally dribble that much. But whatever. We had the Soko Warriors, man. Joe Cole doing his... Trademark moves. Oh my god. Wow. Let's be calm, guys. They are getting ridiculous headers. Headers. That's ridiculous. Come on. Come on, guys. Don't mix things up for Shaka. Well done, Shaka. Okay, let's, let's try to keep things on. Let's, let's, let's calm things down. We've been unable to retain possession for a long period of time. I was hoping he would have come back really quickly. This is tough, guys. This is tough. Um, these guys are England are getting headers. Oh no. 
I don't know if you guys are hearing me slamming the keys. Though. Come on, let's 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 try to win that one. Win it up front. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Your call is causing some problems, but Roger, big man Roger. Doing the traditional English thing there, trying to go down the wings. Come on guys, we can do this, we can do this. Roger, oh my gosh. I don't think Roger would do that in real life. That's that's my honest opinion. Okay, so here we go guys. If you're just joining us, uh, we are 1-0 up, uh, which is quite a difficult task. And um, you know, I'm having a difficult time against England. Uh, we're 1-0 up, but uh, I'm trying to... Oh no. Come on, keep him out. No default, you're not going to score. Let's keep, keep control, guys. Keep control. You guys know how to play this game. That's not bad. Not, oh, not bad. Win back by Roger. I'm trying to use his physical presence. Let's try, to, let's try to control the pace of the game so we can we can calm things down because it's been frantic, frantic. Um, I seem to have a lineup that's working. Uh, you know, Tony Roger and these guys. Uh, this lineup seems to be working. Let's try to conserve energy because the English players are faster and a lot quicker. That was a risky pass. Oh. You know, I don't want to just keep the ball for the sake of keeping the ball, but uh, and if I have a chance to create an attack, I'll take it. Come on, Edwards. Joe Cole is giving me a hard time, though. He is giving me a hard time. Oh my god, that piece. No. Oh my god. This is. They, 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 it was coming. It was coming. They were getting headers. And uh, I just got all paced on the wings there. As you can see, my players were just struggling to catch up. And, uh, you know, the English heading stats are quite ridiculous. So let's 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 try to calm things down. Uh, we were losing control of the game a bit. Uh, it all started from that turnover. So let's go, guys. Um, I've been seeing that for the entire game. Just a couple minutes left. We just have to be really disciplined. We may have to play really ugly football. Uh, we can probably take advantage of the high pressure of the English players. I may not like to like this way of playing, but uh, it may serve us well. Uh, we, just, we can't all face these guys, so come on guys, we are the so Warriors, we can do this. Miss Lawrence. Trusting my defenders to do the right thing. Like I said, if I attack, I'll open myself up to some counter attacks. So I'm trying to be really smart here. Um, I'm not going to go for the flare, I'm going for the result. Maybe that's the, the Syria fan in me. Um, because four points would be very crucial and it would be stupid to give, away, give that away. Um, you know. Seem to be holding him off. Oh, that was close. That was close. I'm trying to pull the players towards me. Uh, and this negates because at a legendary level, uh, well, world class, it's these guys are difficult. I try to go toe to toe with them. I am very lucky. I'm at one. And you know we're almost there guys. Come on. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's make some subs. Let's make some subs and see this out. Um, I don't know, you can't tell. I know there are some bars on the screen, but you can't see it now. Um, last time I brought on Colonel Glenn. But I'll bring on Silvio Span. Roger and Russell Latibi might be tired but he's also very skillful so I'm gonna take a chance I'm gonna take off Russell Latibi 
and I'm gonna put on Cornell Lang. I only used two subs last time, but so far we're pretty stable. So we'll see how it goes. I think that that's gonna that's that's how it's gonna go. So come on, guys, we're almost to the end. Come on, England. Not today, England. I'm gonna change history today. We're gonna use some Pep Guardiola football here. Come on, guys. This would be a big, big result for us. That is a long three minutes. Look at my palms. You can't see my palms. <laughs> a 1 1 draw against England. We were losing control of that game. I was losing control of that game in that second half. They were, they were starting to overpower me and I decided to try to, to kill this game off. Uh, you know, we got a chance here. Oh, I wish we scored that. Um, I couldn't keep up with those guys. And uh, I used whatever footballing knowledge I had and tried to slow the game down. And listen, guys, we got a 1-1 draw against England. Uh, this is the goal here. This is the goal here. Some nice replays. I stopped and I aimed. And I got a lovely goal. Dwight York. So Dwight York and Russell Atterby are big guns. I'm doing really well for it so far. I'm pretty sure uh, Sir Ericsson, who was the coach of the time, is not going to like this. Uh, because they went all out in that second half. So if you're just joining me, we are on four points. Um, it looks more than probable if we do things right, uh, based on other results, that we have just improved our chances of getting to the second round of the World Cup, which we did not do in real life. In the first game, I won 1 0 against Sweden, and in this game, I drew 1 1 against England. Uh, let me know what you think in the comment section. What do you think about my tactics? What do you think about what I'm doing? Um, if this excites you or not, and you know, this brings back memories of us being at the 2006 World Cup. Leo Ben Hacker, wherever you are, listen, reach out to me, man. Reach out to me, man. Let me know what you're doing. Uh, guys, Kenwin, Russell Atterby, Roger, you guys, we've been speaking. Let me know what you think. I know, Kenwin, you are a bit worried. You said good luck. Listen, man, four points. Four points is not bad. And, uh, you know, for those of you who are just joining us, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment in the comment section below. Show your support because it really helps the channel. I'm doing my best to help everyone out during this COVID-19 by having some fun. And for those of you who are not aware, I am from Trinidad and Tobago. That's where our show is from. We have fans from all over the planet, Malaysia and so on, UK, Canada and so on. And I hope you guys are enjoying this. And stay tuned because we're going to play the final game against Paraguay. So let's, let's go ahead and see... Uh, What's happening here? So we had some good stats, you know, obviously one goal each. Um, and was it Michael Owen who scored it? Would we see that here? Let's see. Uh, yeah, it was Owen. And I have to admit, England's stats are ridiculous. These guys were getting headers, as you can see in the replay. It was, it was dumb. I mean, they were getting headers from outside the box that were ridiculous. But Shaka Hislop, Mr. ESPN FC. We did an interview with him. Check out that link in the description below. A lot of interviews recently with a lot of topics, plus a Q&A. Uh, he was a big man today. So, uh, we got more shots in this game. Uh, but it was difficult. It was quite difficult. Uh, I had to do a lot of tackles, as you can see. No foul, surprisingly. And uh, But the key point in the game was I was losing control in the second half. They got that goal. They blew past my wing backs, And I had to try to slow things down. Slow things down. And uh, we got the result. So, you know, let's move along. Move along. I, I don't know what these are. I'm guessing uh, it's, it's some sort of reward system i guess you know before the playstations were mainstream so i guess i got something uh i got a negative point i don't know what that means maybe it's because of my possession i don't care got the result so whatever do you want the same changes of course yes so let's see oh so you know we actually have the results we're so disappointed oh so they actually have the actual news and so on so let's take a look at the group it's gonna i'm gonna I'm gonna take a look at the group. So, England is on four points. Trinidad and Tobago is on four points. Sweden is on one point, and Paraguay is on one point. Now we have to play Paraguay up next. So we have to ensure that we get to be safe, minimally a draw. I mean, I'm gonna try to go for a win. Paraguay is a very difficult team. I said that way back in 2006, when I was just a little fresh-faced fanboy. That Paraguay, to me, was the most dangerous team. And uh, we can, we lost to them. You know, that's a game Russell had to be played and Kelvin Jack uh, finally made his debut at the World Cup because he had an injury. So we'll see. So that is a crucial game. That is a crucial game. I'm going to try to get 
our first objective done which is to get to the next round so let me know what you think thank you for watching and be sure to comment subscribe share and keep supporting extra time tv